plugged in. Here I am at Hohebarde or Ayanati Hohenwarsleben Magdeburg. And next to me is an I-4. It's full house at Allego, almost. And Etron just left next to the ID4. I'm really sad that I couldn't take a picture of all of us together. Let's see. This time I didn't do a 0% arrival, so I hope to get nice charging speeds here. I wonder about the amperage as well, because this charger can obviously go further than the last one I used. Yes. The full 250 amps that this vehicle can take. What I also think is a bit funny is that this lineup at Ionity with the ID4 and the I4, and then look at what's going on at Allego several Teslas, even a Porsche, and over there is the V2 supercharger where it used to be very crowded always but now there's a v3 on the other side of the road and apparently these teslas i think they they like the food here because there's a mcdonald's around the corner and a burger king and uh, the v3 at the other side of the highway has only a gas station look at this peugeot rocking 101 kilowatt charging speed meanwhile the id4 is doing 120 also not bad 325 amps is that a hard limit I don't know might be oh the Porsche is leaving over there too late to check on the charging of the Porsche and the i4 huh that's weird they didn't do any preconditioning oh the Porsche is gonna try the Ionity charger that's also fun some Swedish Tesla drivers here I wonder what they are getting 111 kilowatts at 61 percent seems to be a casual model 3 and a german model 3 over here no contactless payment yet only 30 kilowatts but that's because they're almost full in just 40 minutes good fun at allego <laughs> I wonder if these Taycan guys had issues paying for the Allego charge. 89 kilowatts after 7 minutes. The Porsche guys have the car brand new and tried to use a green choice card at Allego and it didn't work. Really strange. It's a Dutch charging card that should work fine at Allego. And here's the Polestar arriving. And an EQS. Powered Tuesday. EQS connecting with 20%. 160 amps from the start. Ah, and going up. To 300 plus amps. 350 plus amps. 400 plus amps Wow, this is a beast 500 amps sharp at the EQS at 20% Polestar doing 366 amps also around 20% Not bad ID4 still doing 80 kilowatts at 60% we are only doing 63 kilowatts at 52 percent and of course we have to check in with the Taycan which touchscreen for some reason doesn't seem to work so i can't get the statistics but 106 kilowatts at 77 percent and i plugged in with 60 percent let's do a small update eqs still pulling 420 amps 20% in, 23 kilowatt hours in 8 minutes, not bad, and we have the Polestar still pulling 125 kilowatts, 
almost 20 kilowatt hours in almost 10 minutes ID4 is stopping the charge we are still doing 56 kilowatts now I4 is leaving and the Porsche is still hustling at 86 kilowatts several people leaving new spots for the next one I have to say quite impressed by this Peugeot in the heat still pulling 57 kilowatts it's probably because I have the AC on and will we see the drop at 80% again let's be there live with all the tritium statistics <laughs> trying to get a good angle but the, the weather isn't helping of course There we go, 80%. Drop incoming. Yes, we hit it. Time to go.